Hello, my name is Karak32, and welcome back to our Greg Tech New Horizon Season 2. I am actually just taking a little break from building the base. I figured it was time to level up some crops because uh, I really want to get the. I really want to get like. Uh, 23 growth, 31 gain, just to get the best crops. I can uh, now that we have some of the crop synthesizers. I really want to get that up. Uh, I wanted to upgrade our spruce so I can get uh, start piping that into the UU matter, the amplifier. Um, so I wanted to get the best crops that I could. Also, I still have no idea what that. What is that? I have no idea what that is. Is it something like, I don't know what it is. <laughs> it's the weirdest thing. Uh, if you place a block over it, it still, it still does it. So it's not like, it's not like, I don't know what it is. <laughs> Maybe it's just something in the world, in the void world. Uh, but yeah, so I have just built a little platform off here for growing crops. Uh, just to keep it separate than that, just in case something happens and uh, weed start spreading or something like that. I didn't want to like ruin all my crops, so best to just have this off to the side. Also, you may notice I've moved my world accelerators. I wasn't actually using them, so I just moved them over here. Um, because it actually makes this much easier. If I... Uh, accidentally like break a crop or something like that this grows it in seconds as we saw that was just what three seconds it fully grown um, it needs to be on tile entity though to work with these crops so it does need to be right next to it um, but it also makes it faster um, when you're trying to crossbreed as well so basically all I'm doing is seeing what crop grows 1711 that is an upgrade I'm just gonna go look at the worst crop we have so 1510, 159. Well, that's the worst one we have. Let's get rid of it. Move that over and crop read again. So, yeah. I do have this turned down as well. I probably could keep it on the, the highest setting, uh, but this does take 12,000 EU. I mean, we have plenty of EU stored in our battery right now, um, but. You know, if that starts dropping, which it does look like it is, we'll just let it run for a little bit, and then we can always just turn it off, let that fill up again. Um, which actually, you know, we are voiding power anyway, so. Uh, it doesn't really matter, to be honest. I should look into upgrading these, actually, now that I'm thinking about it. Why don't I upgrade these? Uh, I could put the better, the Oracalcum in now that we can. I think the problem before was we couldn't smelt up our Oracalcum, could we? Also, uh, occasionally these have maintenance problems, so I do have to check on them every once in a while. But uh, yeah, so yeah, this is our farm. So we got a special crop here. Copper ore berry. I don't need that. So just get rid of it, and then we will place the next one. So as we can see, that was what? A few seconds that it uh, we got a new crop. Stick read also grows super, super quick. So it is the best one to work on. Uh, I don't think I want the, even though 17 is better, the gain 9, not better. I'm going to get rid of it. So basically, I only want crops that 11 gain or... 15 no 16 yeah but uh anyway we'll just kind of let this you know what i'm doing you know i'm i can just do this while i'm watching something else on youtube it's actually kind of relaxing just to not have to be planning stuff out just kind of uh doing this all right you're done and then Every once in a while, I have to go charge up my wand. Uh, I really should look into a better wand. 
Maybe thomium caps. I don't remember if... I can't remember if the... Uh, the st I don't think staff can hold... Can the staffs hold wand cores? I can't remember. I'd have to look. Staffs are weird. I do remember that. I, I don't think they actually can. Maybe not staff. Is it staff? Uh, more V, since they're fishing with so they can be used as weapons. Yeah, I don't. Re I, honestly, I don't remember if. Uh, I don't think they can use wand. The wand things. Also, I don't remember what the next tier up of Wand is. What comes after Silverwood? <laughs> I don't remember. Uh, but I think... Yeah, like Thaumium, Silver Bust. I think is... Yeah, not Scepter. Unfortunately, Scepter can't hold the Wand things, even though they're bigger. So... It's these that... Yeah, this staff thing, pretty sure. I may actually have one. Uh, but maybe I will work on... Here, I do have a staff. Let me... I'm going to try that. I, I'm like 99% sure the, the things don't work on it. But if they do... It lets me it lets me pull it up, but I can't No, it doesn't work. <laughs> Wait, turn it off. Wait, it does? Hold on. Ah, staffs can't be charged in there. That's the annoying bit. <laughs> uh that's right. Nope. I remember there was something annoying about it. They don't fit in there, so we can't charge them an easy way unless I... I don't even know how I would charge it from that, that node. Alright. It's been a while since I worked with stats. I do remember them being kind of funny, though. Uh, anyway. Uh, yeah, so that is kind of what I'm doing right now. Probably going to do this for a little while until we can get some... We'll see how far I get. Maybe I'll do this for you know, half an hour or something like that. And uh, see, see what we can get. All right, we are back. And uh, as we can see, I'm up to gain 28. And you may notice the growth is way lower. And part of the reason for that is because I got up to 23 and then I was starting to get crossbreeding that was 24. And it would act like a weed and destroy farmland. So I didn't want to accidentally destroy all my crops. So what I have decided to do, and uh, it has actually helped with leveling them up as well, is I've used our crop synthesizer to create some crops. So basically I've done the stick read and I'm using the 15 growth that we got from before to kind of like lower the the seeds. And I am using the, the, the 28 that we've gotten. I've worked it up to 28. I started with 22 and then uh, I got a 24 crop. So then I created a data orb with that, created two more, 26. And 28 is the final one. Unfortunately, I am running out of... You matter. Stick reeds are tier four, so they need two buckets each. So I don't have enough for two more. Uh, so that's kind of where I'm at right now. But uh, I'm going to wait to get a crop of 30 gain. Uh, and then we'll create another one at that point. And then the 31 will be our final one. Uh, but yeah, like I said, I definitely need some more you, you matter uh, for that to work. But I think in general that's. Probably the easiest. And once we get a 31, 
I don't ever have to level up crops ever again. I can literally just get the crop that I need and then create it with perfect stats kind of thing. I do have a 23 growth. Uh, I have it saved in just in the A system. So, yeah, we got our spruce bonsai I made. There's our growth 23, a redstone lily. And I've gone ahead and made a bunch of spruce bonsai because they are actually really cheap to make. They only require, I actually don't need the those anymore. They only require half a bucket. So I made some of those because I I need you, you matter. And I decided let's just go ahead and throw a export bus and uh, recycle the the spruce down for scrap, which will help with the fabricator. So as we can see, it, it is 40 seconds uh, with the UU amplifier. It'll be only 10 seconds. But as we can see, I'm not making that super fast. There we go. So it's only 10 seconds with that. Uh, we're not making this super fast. You do need nine of this to create one bucket of that uh, amplifier. So what I'm actually doing is crafting up a recycler. Uh, I think we'll just do this. It's relatively cheap. Uh, we should be, yeah, we're crafting up the uh, the piston right now, the two pistons. Uh, I will do the, you want to try the quantum? Right, I haven't really automated these yet. That does require those. Yeah, I was working on this. You know what? I am actually going to do that. I mean, I could do nano as well, but you know what? We're going to need to work towards that. So let's go ahead and do this, I guess. Now, oh, that's right. I needed, I don't remember. We do have some, I don't remember how much osmi or osmium and iridium we need. Or did I really only have like one? <laughs> yeah, I have almost none. Uh, I didn't realize how little iridium and osmium I have. Oh, does this need to be, this may need to be ivy. Yep. Ooh, and it takes 40 seconds. This isn't uh, the easiest thing in the world to make. Um, we do need to get that going, and I will uh, pretty soon here. Question is, should I just leave that? Yeah. Eh. It's a two. I'll just leave it in there. I was just debating. I'm like, should I throw it in here? But I don't, it's not going to work anyway. I would have to change that. So there's no point in throwing it in there. But uh, yeah, I guess we'll do the poly oil. Now I do have, I created all this poly stuff originally. I was like, how did I get so much? That's actually that, that stuff that creates string. Uh, we already have the plates, so I can just do the, man, this is hard to see. Black on. Is there any way I can make it easier to see? Not really. Where is the foil? There it is. No, oh, I bought a patterns. Not completely out. I'm like, now I'm thinking about it. Is this kind of, this probably is kind of a bit of a waste, isn't it? <laughs> to, to use these. 
we're using platinum and stuff and i don't have that fully automated yet but if i do the nano version of it i mean look i mean this is like 13 circuits no i think i do want to do this let's see we'll do hss s I do have the ingots, so let's do a recipe for plate. And, well. Uh, yeah, plate's in there, and then I don't remember how full do we... I think we have plenty of room. I don't have, yeah, I have room for two more. So does that get everything I need for this? Yeah, all right, cool. So yeah, this, see this uses, well, I already have four created, but I'm like, this is only two more things. But uh, all right, so we are using advanced SMDs. Now the cool thing about this is it does create 32 of the capacitors. So, it's we're only using we're only using two i think right two each oh it's actually four each so we are using eight as opposed to 16 of those or eight as opposed to 32 of those for both of these uh eh, probably probably not worth it just for this stuff randomly right now but yeah We'll just use it. All right, so yeah, I will continue to do this. Uh, I'm gonna craft up this recycler. We'll throw it right here, and then I can just plug it in right there next to the IV stuff. Uh, because yeah, this is pretty slow. Um, and I think we should, I have, I think eight. Did I get eight crops? What did I? I don't remember what I crafted up. Eight crops or something like that for spruce. So hopefully we will be, you know, doing okay there. I could always throw, if I really wanted to, I could always throw the, the accelerator on the crops if we need to. But uh, all right. Anyway, uh, enough of that. Okay. So I got these up to 29 just from crossbreeding and then i ended up getting it wasn't even a stick read i think it was a, a hops of a 31 so i have gotten the absolute best stats here so we got 23 growth 31 gain, and then zero resistance we don't need so basically whenever we get any sort of crop from crossbreeding, I can just get the species and then print perfect stats. I don't have to level up anything anymore. Also, the when you're making the seeds, they don't stack. That's why I have this drawer right next to it, so I could let them run uh, because it was a bit annoying. It wouldn't. It would. It would stop working when you had one seed in there. So yeah, I am pretty happy with that. That we finally got that up because i'm sure there's gonna be other crops i don't lean too heavily on crops but some stuff is just so convenient um getting resources for so uh, i have thrown i did create a couple spruce bonsais with 2331 um and then i just actually have a world accelerator running i don't have it on the fastest uh, because it just uses too much power at this point. Uh, so it's only consuming 3,000 to speed up four crops. I mean, it's not the greatest. And to be honest, the <laughs> the recycler is tearing through that. So I was actually debating, I'm like, should I just go ahead and get this tree growth simulator? Maybe I should. If I want to create UU Manor with this now that i have a iv thing i mean that is tearing through the the wood but as we can see it's producing scrap much faster 
Um, and it's actually producing it faster than this mass fabricator uses it. So that is cool. But unfortunately, we are, <laughs> even with that world accelerator on really good crops, uh, we are still going through wood pretty dang quick. So, uh, yeah, I may, uh, should I just do that farm? It's Eglin. This stuff is like super easy. HV, stainless. And then the. It's only a 3x3x3, three by three by three, so it is small. And I've never seen it before, so maybe I will just do that. Um, yeah, probably. I'll keep the spruce plants there. I didn't do them just for those spruce plants. I, did, I wanted max crops just so I could use them in the future as well. Oh, that's like, that's even easier than I thought it would be. <laughs> yeah. All right. Let me uh, craft that up. We'll be right back. Okay, that was relatively easy. I do need a saw or chainsaw, so I'm just going to do a chainsaw. Vibrant alloy seems to be the best one at the moment. I haven't really done a lot of research if Vibrant alloy is the best I can do right now. Uh, but we'll just do that. Also, it's giving me a full... It's, it's an empty battery, but it's giving me... It's fully charged. Interesting. Uh, but, uh, all right, there we go. There is a chainsaw. And we can put it in this thing. Also, I noticed this creates oak logs, which... Uh, my drawers and stuff is all set up for spruce. I was thinking about just throwing it underneath here. How would I get that in there? What do I have above this? You know, I could actually just... <laughs> I could just build... No, how would I power it, though? Wait. I'm trying to remember... How I've done all this. Yeah, that stuff's powered by HV, isn't it? Hmm. Well, I have each. You know what? I crafted up a. I crafted up a EV energy hats, but I actually have HV energy hatches. Let's just we'll do that until. I just kind of want to see how fast this works, and then we can. We can see. Do yeah. That's all I think. Like, is there any way I can... Yeah, I can do that, I think. We'll do output bus. There. Wait, that's not it. <laughs> Needs to go up one. We'll have to pipe the... I'll just have to throw a, a pipe there. Uh, so, input bus, I think, is for... The chainsaw? I usually like putting the maintenance hatch underneath the controller, but if I do this here, I can't. That is HV, yeah. All right, so there is that. And then muffler, does it go anywhere? Any casing. We'll put it on top. Okay, so I think that is pretty much it though, isn't it? There. And the casings for a three by three hollow block, which is pretty much how all these Greg Tech things work. Just hollow. Hello boxes. I kind of wish they had a bit more variety, but oh well. All right. I'm just gonna say that is super ugly. <laughs> just my opinion. That is one ugly multi-block. That color is just not. 
pleasant on the eyes, in my opinion. All right, so I think we just put that. Okay. Oh, it, why do we need an input bus then? I mean, I guess I could throw more in there, but I don't want more. <laughs> They're kind of a pain to make. Uh, anyway, uh, let me grab a thing over here and we'll see how fast this goes. Uh, this should be fine. This does a stack a second. I don't think this is going to be producing that more than a stack a second. We... We'll see. All right, let me uh, stop this. I do wish it did spruce, but I would I would design this a bit differently if I had spruce. I would probably put it over by the thing. All right. Actually, let's do this so I can see. Five seconds. Seventy-four wood. Seventy wood. Forty-three. All right. So what? How does that work? Is it just a random amount? I don't know. I'm curious if it keeps up with it. Which it? Yeah, maybe not. Ah, uh, maybe yeah, it might be actually. I think. Oh, it does look like it's keeping up with it. Hmm, interesting. All right, cool. Well, uh, I'm going to... There's no point to have our spruce. We're wasting power now. If I'm going to use that to do that, we'll just turn that off for now. I could even place it back here, but we are swimming in aluminum as well. So, yeah, we can see 23,000, and that's... Isn't it 2 to 3 ratio? So... That's a lot of aluminum. So we can see the certain crops are definitely super powerful. Um, these, I could... You know what? I can't actually... These are tier 10. I can't synthesize them with the the thing that I have, unfortunately. But, I mean, like, that's awesome. Those resources are absolutely awesome. Uh, and, and look how much ender pearl we have now since... Now that they are being fertilized, kept fertilized, they weren't before. Fertilized water. And they're not even perfect stats either. So, yeah. Uh, I should get some more blaze reed. Tier 6. Uh, what's the... Get rid of these. Still need to do the, the water. Um, or oxygen and hydrogen. The crop synthesizer needs tier two divided by two as voltage level. I already forgot what I just said. What did I say? <laughs> tier tier plus two divided by two. The so four. Three is HV. So I need a synthesizer of tier four i would need an ev synthesizer yeah and these things are these things are no joke so yeah i can't quite do that yet but we we will i wanted to get prepared which is why i wanted to level up to get the stats that i want i don't there are ways you can do like 31 31 crops i don't think it's really worth the hassle but I don't know, maybe maybe we'll we'll do something with that. But uh all right, so is this keeping up? Yeah, it's it's like just about there, isn't it? Sometimes it it gets a bigger bump. Yeah, so look, now we're up to two thirty five. It's basically keeping up with an IV. Obliterator, which is actually pretty cool. I like that um, because we are producing, you know, UU matter as fast as, well, not as fast as possible, but 
using amplifier for every bucket of mass fabricator i will take it and we'll just let that run all right so yeah just uh basically today i i really just wanted to get crops going so for future but uh Yeah, um, I do need to figure out the main location for my controller. Still haven't done that yet because it's getting <laughs> it's getting a little difficult to get all the things in. I would rather do this sooner than later because it gets even more complicated when you're trying to move hundreds of channels. Uh, so that may be, and I kind of wanted it, to be honest, right here. Well, that... <laughs> That didn't really work. Although, I probably could have put that underneath. If I'm not piping this stuff in underneath, I probably could have just put it right here. And I might actually do that. Upgrade it to EV. But, uh, yeah. I just wanted to check it out, at least. But anyway, that's going to be it for today. So thanks for watching, and have a good one.